But now, all of us, the producers, the citizens, the taxpayers, we are the extremists. See how this works? Not the unions, not the ACLU, not the illegal alien support groups, not the moveon.orgs, or the Daily Cause, or the Code Pinks, and none of the true wacko kooks in our culture. They are not the extremists. They are the Democrat Party leftist constituency, but we, we the people, we are now denounced by the Democrat Party as extremists. The, the Democrats, folks, speaking bluntly and speaking honestly, the Democrats have driven this nation to the brink of bankruptcy and instability. They have leased our country out to the chi through massive debt. They have destroyed Social Security and Medicare. They are destroying the value of the U.S. dollar. They are destroying the housing market. For God's sakes, they're destroying everything. And we, we have to hear we are the extremists. We're trying to save. We genuinely love this country the way it was founded. We're trying to defend it and preserve it and save it. We're the extremists. Fine. Then we need more of us. The Democrat Party, Senator Schumer's party, has populated the federal courts with the most radical lawyers in the country. They have encouraged this massive bureaucracy to rule over us through endless regulations like this cap and trade from the EPA. They've caused millions of people to lose their jobs, to lose their businesses, lose their investments, but we are the extremists. Take a look at what has happened since the Democrat Party took the reins of this country in toto, starting first in 2007 with Pelosi in the House and then Barack Obama in 2009. You take a look at what has happened. And through most of those years, there's not one thing that could have been done to stop them in the Democrat fashion because we didn't have the votes. The number of people living in homes is at an all-time low. Home vacancies, foreclosures, uh, nothing's right. This is not how it was supposed to be. The New York Times lead columnist is praying to God for luck for our dear president. We are the extremists. The greatest danger your kids and grandkids face today is not from bullies. It's from the Democrat Party. They are spending so recklessly and so fast, your kids and grandkids are doing all they can and still will bear the brunt of this, the massive printing of paper, the massive debt that we owe ourselves, the massive debt we owe the Chicoms. Schumer and his party spending the wealth of the next generation, the next generation, and will be working harder and harder and longer and longer to pay for all this, yet we are the extremists. Sorry, it's the other way around.